Hello, everyone. Welcome to the six week break free from monotony challenge. I will be sharing my screen real quick. So there you are. As you already know, this is the 42 break process for you to break free from a life that no longer represents you so that you get to create the life of happiness that you deserve. Now I'm Alex, I'll be your guide throughout this journey. I've applied this method so that I could also escape from a life that did not represent me. I was this lawyer here who was a bit lost as you see, borderline depressed. And with these practices, I got to get the clarity and take the actions I needed to take so that now, as you probably know me, I can be this international yoga teacher who is happy in a place, in a city that supports his values and his lifestyle. And this is what I wish for you. So throughout this last decade, I was able to work with private clients, with clients, so that I would pass on this information and they would get to see similar results, breaking free from a place where they felt a bit more stuck and unsure and unrepresented and actually be the great people they want to be with the happy life they deserve to have. So I will now explain to you how we will work. All I need you to do is a nine minute video every day that follows the parts cubed coaching model. There will be more about the parts cubed co coaching in uh, the next video that you will have to watch. But now we'll talk to you about the whole process. So there's six weeks. We start with week one. So week one is account accountability. <laughs> so you get to be accountable for who you choose to be every day, how you choose to show up every day so that you see that you're no longer a victim of situations. Yes, there are things that maybe you cannot change and you have to accept, but there's a lot of things that depend on you, your mindset and your choices. You always have the freedom to choose. So this is for you to be accountable for the choices you take every day and understand a bit more of what's going on in your life and why it's going on rather than hiding behind, well, your fingers, your thumb, a tree. So now second week will be about breaking free from those habits and from those parts of you. We'll be working with the parts model as you will learn about in our next video. So the idea is that you are now blending with different parts of your mindset, of your persona, of your personality. And we want to create some space so that you get a better perspective, so that you unblend from these parts and yet that you see that there are actually other options or it's not just who you think you are that you are. It's just habits and you can make a difference in your life if you choose to make a difference. That will get us to week three, when we get to understand all of these parts a bit more so that we get to love every part of ourselves. So this is when you understand and appreciate every part of your mindset, of your mind, of your personality, and you understand why they're there, what they're trying to achieve. Once you know their agenda and once they see that you can see them and that you support them and that you no longer criticize them for what they're trying to do, then there's a better healthy relationship between you and yourself, basically, so that you now know what you're working with. You appreciate everything that's there and you use it as a tool to go on forward and actually make the changes that you deserve to make so that you can be happy. This gets us to week four, when we actually start with the external actions. So you now have more clarity, you know what you're working with. Now it's about seeing this word of infinite possibilities that you're working with, because now you know that it's not just what you thought to be true, but you get to ask yourself what other possibility there is than what I think to be true. And could that be the life that supports my health and happiness? That way, with this mentality of the word is my oyster, you get to choose your own oyster, the oyster you are willing to live in. Once you make these, these choices, you do not just stay in the theory. We go in, five, in week five, and that's when you burn your boats. The imagery is the following. 
You now know which islands you want to conquer. You get on there with your boat. Well, you don't want the boat to wait for you. And with the first doubt, you get back on your boat and you go back into the life that does not represent you. So week five is about making external commitments and taking actions to make sure that you get to change something slowly but surely you start making those commitments with people you know or sending those emails or taking those actions you need to take so that there's no looking back and that will ensure you that you can actually go to week six and claim sorry for that your best life <laughs> so this is why we're here we're all freedom claimers so you get to enjoy this new life in just five weeks from now, week six, every day, you do the work so that you live in this best life that you deserve to live in. And now it sounds scary and overwhelming, but I reassure you that in five weeks, it will sound even scarier and a lot more effort to stay, to continue to stay where you are than to take those actions to live the best life that you get to live. So there you go. These are our six weeks and your mission for this six weeks, so the 42 days, is the following. As I already said, you need to do your practice. You need to do your practice every day. That's what you're committing to. Every day you do your nine minute practice. So every day there will be a video uploaded in the Abiasa tab right under these videos that you're watching right now, uh, inside our Break Free From Monotony course, every day you have to do your video, not leave it until the end of the week and do six videos consecutively. That's not how it works. Every day you have to do your, your video because that consistency will keep you accountable and you will keep you going. So you do that every day, nine minutes, maybe at the same time every day, maybe not. And then when you do it, you share your success. So in the Sangha tab, there's the Freedom Claimers community and on there, you can find the sharing success channel. I ask you every day, once you do your practice to simply post on there, day one, done, day two, done. If there's something more you want to write, something that's coming up, you can share it. You can take advantage of it to journal something because that's why you have the community to support you, to see that everyone is going through the same struggles and everyone has their you know, eyes on the prize. So this is what we're doing every day. You're posting about it. You're celebrating your consistency. And that way in 42 days, you get to break free from monotony. The other couple of things on the Sangha tab that you can see is the introduce yourself part. If you haven't done that yet, please do so. You'll see how to do it on there so that you remind yourself why you're here, what you get, what you want to get out of it, and you become accountable. Once you name it, we know about it, and you know about it, and we hold you accountable so you don't stop until you see results. And then, as you see, there's also another couple of channels that you can use at any point already if you want to, so that the Q&A and the tips and tricks channels and on there you can post whatever is going on if you have questions if you found some gems along the way so that you remind yourself you ask people and you also get others to celebrate what you find along the way and learn from you too this is all for now what you need to do is just go at the end of this section under this video and click on complete or next, whichever one is true for you. You click on there and then you watch the next video that talks about the coaching model that you'll be working with. I'm so excited for you. Thank you for being part of this. This is amazing. I can't wait to see your incredible results and may you be free. <laughs>